It's opening night. Oh, say hi. 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 Oh my god. We are so excited. Are we excited, right? Yeah. Now? Oh my god. Beyond oh. excited. I just. I'm so excited. I just ran into this fire thing, which is really scary. I am running around like a crazy person, uh, delivering these really lovely opening night gifts that I don't know if you can see and I'm gonna go ignore the do not disturb button that is put on her door and send, leave her a lovely little ditty. Janet Krupen who plays Kyler, tell Playbill.com how you feel right now. Oh my god, she's making her Broadway debut. Three minutes to stun call folks. Oh I really wish. I Open it! Oh my god, I I don't know what's going on. I love Ari. Oh my god, do you love being on Broadway? I love it. Sheldon, what does it mean to you to be on Broadway? Ah! Oh my god, I was a terrible videographer, okay. but that was amazing. Thanks. Did you see that? That's how happy he is to be on Broadway. I can't even tell you, the energy in this room, on this stage right now, is electric. I personally have never felt anything like it. Everyone is so happy and thankful to be here. It's incredible. It's opening on Broadway. Oh my god. What? It's cheer call. Balls. How many dudes can pick up girls all day? Amazing. Callie, how old are you? 19. You're 19 years old making your Broadway debut. Yeah. That's I amazing. I know. I'm kind of still peeing myself. <laughs> I kind of can't believe it. Jump one, two, go three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, go three, four, five. I'm here to welcome you to the Gypsy Rub ceremony for opening night on Broadway. Woo! Row. Yes. And everybody who's making their Broadway debut tonight, come to the summer. Gypsy Go? Oh my god. Three. This is We're stunning. actually going on the next one. We're, we're going on the next one. <gasps> there better be so shiny cool. things on it, I'm just saying. I'm saying. I, or some pom poms. At least a pom. <laughs> cheer bow. We'll have a cheer oh my bow. God. Before this camera dies, I just want to take a minute. As you can see, I'm kind of crying for a second. Um, my mom wrote me this beautiful letter. And um, it just kind of made me sit down and realize like how truly blessed I am, how much we all are, because this is so special. Being in this community is so special, and it's not, it's not dark upon me or anyone else here, and we are all so thrilled to be here, and we all keep saying the same thing, but it's because it's true. This is an incredible, incredible community, and it means a lot to be here, so thank you for giving us the chance to be here, and now we do what we do every night on that stage for all of you, and you know, for those of you confused about what you should be doing with your life or whether to take one road or to take another, you know what? Take the road less traveled. It's worth it. I gotta stop winking. It's really unattractive. <laughs> You're recording yourself. Happy opening. Bye. <laughs> there was a moment in the show where I just looked up and saw the lights and just streaming tears. I was a total nerd in that moment, but it was really special. It's incredible when you feel so welcomed into this theater community because it's an amazing, amazing family. Like to be in New York is, it's a dream. So I'm so excited. Being on stage tonight was just uh, unreal. I, I cried like five times. <laughs> it was hard to stay composed doing the show because I just looked out in the audience and thought like, oh my God, this is real. I actually didn't expect it to be as emotional as it was. Um, I was uh, crying in my dressing room and crying on stage during the gypsy rope ceremony and crying backstage during the final song that actually I'm not even in and it was it was really, really wonderful. I've been doing this for a while and this has been one of the most amazing nights I think I've ever had. Just the energy from the audience, the energy from the cast. We were so riled up backstage that I couldn't even sit still in my dressing room 
I'm trying to put my makeup on. It's the end of a small journey and the beginning of something bigger than I could have ever imagined.